What's your favorite memory of a bone? Um, my favorite memory of a bone is uh, probably sitting on the curb and eating like uh, the teriyaki and rice. What do you like to do at a bone? Uh, I enjoy probably playing games and eating teriyaki and rice the most. <laughs> Um, and when I was in Weeblos, I volunteered uh, for a bone, and even after I stopped doing Weeblos, I still volunteered for a bone, and worked at the game booths. Did you ever help with the setup? With the setup, well, my dad's head of construction, so um, I often help with setup okay, before a bone. <laughs> uh, if people want to support the cause, uh, where can they get more information? Well, if they want to support the cause or just even just get more info on the San Jose Betsuin Obon, then they could go to sjbetsuin.org and if, if you're there in the website, you could go to the, there's links to the GoFundMe page, the merchandise, and even if you just want to support, it's, it's there on the website. Um, yeah. Can you spell that? SJ Betsuin is no spaces, is SJ. Uh, B E T S U I N dot org. SJ Betsuin dot org is the website. SJ Betsuin, and then there's a link for GoFundMe, mm -hmm. and then the link for merchandise sales on the website t shirts, tank tops, bags, aprons. Okay, I think that's it. Kugura Company has been around since 1928. The store has been passed down to generations within the Kugura family. At Kugura Company, you can buy various Japanese items such as flour vases, rice cookers, plates, and so much more. Come in and shop at Kugura Company. Hi, my name is Michael Ho. And I'm Kendall Ho. And we are a part of the San Jose Betsuin. Dharma School. Boy Scout Troop 611. And YVA. During Obon, we get to see familiar faces while enjoying good food. But at the end of the day, we all come together and dance for our ancestors. We are sad that we are not able to participate in the festival this year. However, we do plan to do so uh, in next year's Obon Festival. If you would like more information, please visit our Facebook page, or you can visit our website at www.sjbetsuin.org. That is sjbetsuin, B-E-T-S-U-I-N dot org. It is also good for buying merchandise. Thank you for listening, and we hope everybody stays safe. Hi, my name is Emily Nakashima, and I am part of the Girl Scouts and the Junior YBA here at the Betsuin. If you've ever been to Robon, you may have noticed the lanterns that hang above 5th Street. Each one of those were hand-decorated in remembrance of a loved one, and each have a hanging tag identifying that person or a special sentiment. Obon is a time where we can come together to remember and show gratitude for those we have lost. In the spirit of Obon, you can visit our In Memory Giving page. You can find the links in the chat box on Facebook, or you can visit www.sjbetsuin.org. That's sjbetsuin, B-E-T-S-U-I-N dot org. Thank you. Well, it's spring in San Jose, but it's hardly like vacation. Cause you're stuck at home in quarantine But at least there's still Roy Station You can don a mask and gloves And then head to 5th and Jackson Social distance on the patio With a cold brew for relaxin' Thank you God and Buddha too We've got Roy's to see us through Brewing coffee just for you 
They've got barbecue pork buns too. Oh, it's the heart of San Jose. In a world of dull hodgepodge, it's the perfect family coffee shop made from Grandpa's old garage. Long live Joe! Long live Royce! Royce Station! Hi everybody, my name is Eric Chu. And I'm Alex Chu. And we're a part of San Jose Junior YBA. We hope you guys are enjoying Obon at home so far. Every year we enjoy the food, performances, and activities during Obon. But especially food. My favorite memory of Obon is walking down the food aisle and smelling all the delicious food. And one thing that I miss about Obon is catching up with all my friends and family throughout the weekend. If you'd like more information about Obon or today's events, you can check out the links in the chat box on the Facebook page. Or you can visit www.sjbetsuin.org. That is S-J and then Betsuin, B-E-T-S-U-I-N dot org. Thank you for joining us. Thank you. My name is Eiko Yamaichi, and this is a memory of my husband, Jimmy. And I'd like to say a few words about him. Jimmy was a member of the board for 40 years and president for one, and also was the chairperson for one year for the Obon and a committee member for 30 plus years. It was a time of gratitude and appreciation for those who passed on for making life a little easier because of their compassion and effort. Despite all the work necessary, preparations for Obon, he looked forward to the camaraderie and friendship for a successful festival. As the Obon became more popular, the composition of the people became more diverse and interesting. Thank you. My name is Kylie Kaomoto from Junior YBA and Girl Scouts. Obon is a time to acknowledge that our compassion is rooted within our families and friends. In the spirit of Obon, I hope you will take time to reflect about what Obon means to you. If you would like to learn more about what Obon means, you may visit our website. You can find the link in the Facebook chat box or visit www.sjbetsuin.org. That is SJ and then Betsuin. Thank you and enjoy the rest of the program. Hi, my name is Eric Rodriguez and I work for the city of San Jose. If you or your loved ones have been affected by the COVID-19 pandemic, we are here to help you. Visit the city of San Jose's Virtual Local Assistance Center. It's our one-stop online portal to find information on food assistance, housing, and unemployment benefits, including pandemic unemployment assistance and much more. Call 311 or go to sanjoseca.gov slash VLAC. That's sanjoseca.gov slash VLAC or call 311 so we can help you find the information you need. Hello, my name is Alton Oji and I'm part of San Jose's Junior YBA Girl Scouts 
and Dharma School at the Bedswin. This year, Obon looks a little different. What I will miss most about Obon in person is getting to see all my friends, the delicious food, and seeing everyone in the community come together. While you're enjoying San Jose Obon at home online, please consider a donation to the San Jose Buddhist Church, a place that is central to the Japantown community. To donate, you can look for the links in the chat box on Facebook or visit www.sjbetsuin.org. That is SJ and then Betsuin, B-E-T-S-U-I-N dot org. Thank you. Greetings. Uh, my name is Greggy Mahara, and this is my wife, Katrini Mahara. We have two kids, uh, Kai and Ava, and we are honored to have been asked to share our memories of the San Jose Buddhist Church and the San Jose Obon. Um, for us, the Buddhist Church is the cultural beacon. It's the cultural epicenter uh, for the Bay Area, for, for everyone to come together. And they do such a great job, not only from a religious side, but also from a cultural promotion side. Things like the Nikkei Matsuri, uh, there's Boy Scouts that, that are there um, from it. So people from all walks of life, right, kind of converge in, in that area uh, for it. Another extension of the church is what kind of hits home for me is the um, Lotus Preschool. Uh, my kids got the lucky to attend Lotus Preschool, Kai and Deva. Um, it's run by Miss Lynn, who's an amazing director. Um, it's more than a well-run preschool. Um, it's a beacon, it's a cultural beacon, like Greg was saying. It brings families together, creates friendships, new, Friendships, old friendships, my husband, um, all of his friends and their children go there together now. Um, it's very valuable and enriching for the kids um, and the culture. I'm so much more interested in the culture now too. And as for the San Jose Obon, um, it's an iconic event in the community. Um, sad this year that because of COVID we're not able to, to do it, but uh, you know, I grew up going to it. I was a little kid playing tag, uh, you know, there meeting my friends, my zebra teammates, uh, playing the games, eating the food, just having an awesome time without a care in the world because everybody, it was like my big family was there. And now fast forward years later to see my kids meeting their teammates or their friends there, playing tag, playing the games, running around, eating the food. It's awesome to see this cycle of life and to be part of it. It really is just awesome. And it's all due to the Buddhist church and to the Obon. So uh, in spirit of Obon, um, obviously without the Obon happening this year, um, it's our time to remember our ancestors and our gratitude. Please consider donating uh, to the Buddhist Church. You can go to the website, www.sjbetsuin.org. That's S-J, B as in boy, E-T-S-U-I-N as in Nancy.org. Or in the chat box, as you view this video, there should be a link to a GoFundMe a link on the Buddhist uh, Church Facebook page. So uh, I hope to meet everyone soon and thank, thank you. you. Hi, I'm Julianne and I'm part of San Jose Junior YBA and the Diamond School. Obon is always a time to reflect, remember those who have passed and spend time with friends and family. That being said, we're really glad that you tuned in and decided to spend your time with us today. For more information about Obon, and the time schedule, you can look at our website, which is www.sjbetsulin.org. That's www.sjbetsulin.org. Thanks. From the family of JT Express, thank you to everyone who has continued to dine with us in these times. If it's been some time since you've been out with us, there's a few changes. We are open for outside dining and takeout. Thanks to our delivery partners, it's possible to enjoy our food even without coming to us. Our hours have expanded to include breakfast. While we still have Bubbies, Marianne's ice cream, and Spam Musubi, please try some of our new items. Loco Moco, Bento Boxes, and more items are coming. Next time you're in Japantown, please stop by JT Express. Oh, 
しよりひそかに雨よりやさしくあの子はいつも歌ってる声が聞こえる Hello, my name is Kimo Sweeney. I'm a member of San Jose Junior YBA. This year, Obon is virtual. We hope you're enjoying the program so far. One thing I will miss about Obon is hanging out at the Hondo in the warm summer weather with all of my friends. If you want more information about Obon, to view today's schedule, or would like to check out some items that we're selling, look for the links in the chat box on Facebook or visit www.sjbetsuin.org. That is SJ and then Betsuin. B E T S U I N dot org. Thank you very much. Have you been doing this lately? Some of this? More that? And maybe some of this. Stop right there. We have a place where you could go, and there's no lines. Oh, b o w i n g at home! Obon is a time to celebrate our ancestors and remember them. We celebrate with our friends and family, and this year we'll be celebrating Obon at a safe, dis at a safe distance from home. This year we will be dancing in honor and memory of Marvin Aoki, who passed away this year on May 6th, my father, and my mother, Taiko, who passed away in 1999. Both of them loved Obon. And so, everybody, have fun and Obon at home! Now, join us in the spirit of Obon to support the San Jose Buddhist Church. You can visit their website at sjbetsuin.org or click on one of the links to a GoFundMe in the chat. The spelling for the website is sjbetsuin.org. Now, have a good Obon! Thanks, everybody. Well, it's spring in San Jose, but it's hardly like vacation. Cause you're stuck at home in quarantine, but at least there's still Roy Station. You can don a mask and gloves, and then head to Fifth and Jackson. Social distance on the patio with a cold brew for relaxin'. Thank you, God and Buddha, too. We've got boys to see us through. Brewing coffee just for you. They've got barbecue pork buns, too. Oh, it's the heart of San Jose. In a world of dull hodgepodge, it's the perfect family coffee shop made from Grandpa's old garage. Long live Joe! Long live Royce! Royce Day!